Hello everybody and welcome back to Luigi's Mansion. Now one thing that I actually found cool is if you press X here, I didn't even know that this was a thing. Like I thought that this for some reason was the front of the mansion. I didn't even know that this door was here. I saw the uh, the lightning struck so I, and I saw the shadow. <clears throat> My voice is dying. So I looked at the windows. I'm like, wait, are there windows here? And then I noticed the door was here. So it's like, oh, well that's a thing. So, uh, anyway, the reason why the light is on is because I talked to Toad. I totally forgot that the, uh, the light turned on because of Toad. It turned on, you know, after I saved, but whatever. Well, actually, no, it, it turned on after I talked to him. But anyway, what we're going to do today is going to be getting the ghosts, all the ghosts up here, which is probably, like, I don't know, like, maybe, uh, 10, 12, something like that. Now the boulder gust is stronger. I don't know if that, uh, like, I don't know if that affects booze or not. I, uh, <clears throat> hiccuping. Obviously, that affects the, you know, other ghosts. But I don't know about the booze. Now every single time that we get a boo, it's gonna prompt me to save, which I'm not gonna save. I'm just gonna hit B and, you know, because I don't want the uh, video end up corrupting. Cause that has happened to me a couple times before and. It's dumb when it does that. So, hopefully by the end of this video... Oh, that's a fake. Yeah, sometimes they can be fakes, which is kind of annoying, but... Oh, well. So, uh, you know, maybe there'll be, like... I don't know. Maybe I'll have, like, 10, 15 boos by the end of this video. Probably 8 or 10, something like that. I don't know. Now, I think the boos also have more health. I'm not sure, because that one had 50. I think um, last time it had, like, 10. I don't know, though. You, yeah, like, these ones have random numbers, actually. No. Yeah, I'm not good at this uh, control stick. Like, I'm not... For some reason, I'm, like, terrible at multitasking. Like, using the control stick and the uh, C stick at the same time. I don't know why I'm so bad but I am. I guess speedrun stress, I could have took a picture of the mirror, but actually that probably would have been slower because the animation has to play and all that. So obviously I'm doing this because I have to get 40 boos or 45 boos. I think it's actually 45. I'm not sure, but most all the rooms have a boo in them. So if you've been to a room and there wasn't a boo in there before because you didn't like unlock them, this time, there's probably going to be one. The booze won't show up unless you actually have the room lit. Like, see how the chandelier is lit? Because we actually beat the ghost of the room. That's, you know, that's basically the qualifi the qualifications for the boo to show up. Yeah, these booze, like, have puns. Like, they say, like, puns in their names. And it's, like, why, like, taboo, the game boo advance. They just say some random funny stuff, and it's like, it's weird. It's so weird, you just ask yourself why. Is this a... Uh, no, okay. I didn't know if that was a locked door or a trap door. But anyway, let's do this. Get the heart. Because this is a place for the heart. I don't know, uh... Like, we can't exit the room and get the heart back, so I don't know when it actually respawns. Boo should be here. That's a bomb. Yeah, it can either be a bomb, a ball, or a boo. Obviously, the boo is the less uh, dangerous one. The crib? Yeah, it is. Okay. I believe there can only be one fake per boo. Like, you're not going to get the ball and the bomb in one room and then find the boo. It's either going to be the ball or the bomb and then the boo. Okay. <laughs> I thought the game soft locked there because it wasn't doing anything. So we have how many? Six booze? Or five? Okay, so now what EGAT actually said was to go to the washroom because I don't know if this is like a requirement. I don't know if they actually want you to get booze or if it's like a time thing, but the, the washroom wasn't actually open. I didn't check. Like, I didn't actually show you, I don't think. But the washroom wasn't actually open. And now EGAT's like, <clears throat> oh, my throat. But you gads like go to the washroom and you know go clean up because before there was like a toad in there and he's like dude this is occupied and he didn't want you to actually go in there but I don't know why I'm 
saying this as if like you're stupid and don't understand what I'm trying to say. So unfortunately there isn't an actual indicator like per room like when you get a boo. I don't think so anyway. Like I can't really tell if there is. So what we're going to do now is uh, avoid all these ghosts because to be honest I don't really care about them and you don't really need them but I might look for pots. Uh, money I mean yeah pot well technically looking for pots to look for money I guess that makes sense but yeah that did 10 damage I think that normally would have done uh, five so now this room is open and toads in here like what's happening <laughs> I dropped a really important thing to the toilet I didn't mean to now watch this goodbye <laughs> what in the and then it, <clears throat> then you just leave him alone it, I don't know it's hilarious don't worry about it. You pretty much have to do this or else the... Uh, actually, does the game not progress? I don't know. But the light does turn on like in the foyer. And then you go to the toilet. You just get the key. Good thing he didn't actually flush it. I don't know why. Like if he knew that he didn't flush it, he wouldn't have like been crying over it, I guess. This room doesn't have a boo in it. <clears throat> a boo in it. Oh my god. My throat. Yeah, I just woke up. So if my throat's weird, that's probably why. But no boon here. And I don't know how many boos we should have at what at like what point. Six seems like a good number to have in terms of like boos, I don't know. But there definitely will be a boo in the The interesting about this room is there is a boo, but you don't light this room up for a while and you'll you'll see why. Like, what we actually do to light the room. Is this working? Yes, it is. Okay. So, eventually, we get this ghost's, uh, ghost that you can see. This is, like, the fortune teller that looks really weird. And the GameCube, I could never tell what this was. Like, it was so pixelated. Or my TV was. I don't know, but, like, I just couldn't tell what it was. Now, this ghost is quote unquote friendly and you will end up sucking her up and when you do the room will light up and that's when you can actually get the boo so they actually force you to wait on that one this room is actually interesting because you have to look at the mirror to actually know where the boo is now my depth perception is extremely bad especially in this room so i'm gonna shine my light a few times thinking that i know where the ghost is but i'm not going to actually get it you can also look for the dust particles that come out of the boo, or a ghost, I mean. Like, there you could see there was, like, uh, dust particles that came out of the boo when it actually appeared. Now, usually what I'll do is I'll let the boo grab me, just so it, uh, goes behind me so I actually know where it is so I can suck it up pretty much immediately. But in the process of that, you take, uh, more than, you know, you take too much damage and I don't, I don't want to do that. Oops. Yeah, like, look at this. Look how much harder this is. Like, I'm already at 64 health. Nintendo 64 health. Like, you can definitely see that double damage kicking in. I believe that's 20 hearts. Or 20 health. Yeah, sometimes the uh, C-Stick gets, like, out of line. Like, sometimes Luigi will just be pointing it up. And I don't know why he does that. But we got the fire elements. Nice. <laughs> this, is, this, is a, this is a cool one to have. Question marks. Hey Luigi, you found the fire element. As you can see, there's actually a boo in this room, so that's gonna be nice. So the elements, you can actually use the elements to burn the ghosts. If you don't feel like sucking them up, I don't know why you would, but you can actually use the elements on the ghosts, and their health does go down. But like I said, I don't know why you would really do that. You know, like, suck up a ghost, and if the ghost is at, like, I don't know, 3 health, then I guess it makes sense. But, like, if the ghost has full health, it just doesn't seem, like, it just seems pointless, I guess. So, the fire element, some of these fire torches will have these, uh, fire elementals that you can suck up, which will give you a, a flamethrower, basically. Now, how the flamethrower works is you hold L lightly to do this, and then if you press L all the way, it shoots a fireball. Now, I I haven't really made use of, like, the fireball. I don't really know how you would really use that, but, oh well. 40 health. It, it seems like these boos get sucked up faster. That might be me, though. 
Oh, now we're gonna miss that heart because we're talking. Come on. Eh, yes. Trying to be careful because, you know, it is like double damage and I don't want to actually die. I have actually been close to death in the other one. So if I've been close to death in the one that's not double damage, I would not put it past myself to actually die. And the, the death is actually brutal in this game. If you don't save, it'll actually set you back to your last save point. And that's actually really bad for me because I don't like saving while I'm recording because, you know, I don't want it to corrupt or anything. So if I die, it's like I have to start everything over. Oh, there's a key over there. And key. I like how the key just slowly floats to Luigi when you do that. You know, if you think about it, this must be a pretty powerful vacuum if it's able to suck up things that it's able to. Like, I, I, I mean, I guess a key makes sense, but... You know, it also seems like uh, the enemies drop more hearts. That might be me, though. Or it might just be just RNG luck, but... Some of the things that Luigi's able to suck up... Like, a normal vacuum <laughs> would not be able to suck that up. Like, it, it would be way too heavy, but I mean, it's a video game. Why would you expect it to have, like, normal vacuum cleaner uh, physics? Now, the reason why I'm doing this first, I do know what to actually do here. The first time that I ever played this game, I had no idea what I was actually doing, and I probably spent a half an hour trying to figure it out. Because, for that, you know, I didn't want to actually look online. I wanted to figure it out myself. And then I remembered, oh wait, the guy with the candles, you know, it's like, I I had to, I saw him, and I have the fire element, so maybe if I light the candles, it'll actually do something. Yeah, these guys definitely seem to be dropping more hearts, that might just be me though. <clears throat> so, this might actually be longer than I thought, like, I didn't expect this to take that long. Like, we haven't even done that much. Well, we're about to get, uh, like, a big ghost, I guess, but... It, it's mainly, like, unlocking stuff, I guess, if that makes any sense, to, like, easy, easily progress. Now, this door is actually fake. You can actually tell if you look at the thing. You can't see a door there, so you can actually burn the door, and that'll get rid of it. Uh, I believe the door actually comes back, so there's really no point in doing that. But, there should be a ghost here, or a ball, or something, yeah, a ghost. Now, these really small rooms, it, it's really annoying, because it's really, really easy for the boo to actually escape, and if it does, you actually have to follow it into another room. There's actually one case where that's really, really horrible, and I had to keep on going back and forth between rooms, and that probably took me, like, a good five minutes to actually get the boo. And I probably made a trip of, like, or a trip of, like, I probably, like, made a, <clears throat> like, went out, went, uh, I can't even talk, went, went in and out of the room, like, ten times to actually get the boo. So this guy, uh, we light his torch, or candles, I guess, and basically follow him. This probably takes longer than it needs to. <clears throat> It doesn't matter if you get ahead of him, it, it's not like, oh, you have to stay next to him for it to actually count. So what he will actually do, I don't know why I got hurt there, but what he'll do is he'll go over there and then he'll quickly run over here. So you pretty much, it, it's not a race or anything, it's just you can go over here without having to worry. See, he's really fast here. <clears throat> so he's going to come into this room. And the reason why you want to clear that room first is because I don't know if you can actually go in this room or not. Like, I tried to fight the ghost in there, but then... Like, if, if you're not in this room when he is, then it's just really bad. So just uh, get ready to suck. And do this. For some reason, the C-Stick wouldn't actually move. That was really weird. And he is sucked up. Oh, there's a blue gem there. I don't think I've ever gotten that blue gem. Hello. Mine. Now there's actually a really nice treasure room in this, like in this room that I never even knew existed for like the longest time. I, I did like in my last playthrough, but that's, you know, that was, <laughs> I mean like a long time ago, if that makes any sense. Oh, the key just like flew away for some reason. So this key goes to the music room. So let's get the boo here. 
Yeah, getting the boot is probably taking way more time than I actually think, but these are acquired, you know, like it's, uh, I'll come back here. Oh, he has zero health. What is that? So let's do this. For some reason, taking a picture of this causes it to like suck you up. Please don't leave. Oh, come on. I didn't even get a chance to do anything. He has zero health. What even was that? <clears throat> like he has no health. I don't even know how he's able to... Okay, the elemental ghosts, what you do is you spray them with whatever element they are, or the opposite, or whatever. So that guy was ice, so I sprayed him with fire, and then you're able to suck him up. You don't have to kill them with the element, like some people think you do. Which, I've seen a lot of videos where people actually think you have to do that. So just spray them once, shine the light on them, and then suck them up. Now I believe there's a blue ghost in here, which I don't even know if I've gotten any blue ghosts last time, but I think there is a blue ghost in here. Somewhere. I think it's in one of those treasure chests. It might be. You, you know, now I'm wondering about that boo. Like, that boo had zero health. But, I don't know. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know how long the window of opportunity is to actually suck up the ghosts when you have the light on them. But what you want to do is you want to, like, check everything. You want to check out the trophies and all that. Uh, there's fire here. There's candles, I mean. I don't think these candles actually do anything. I'm trying to remember. Yeah, the the thing is you don't want to you don't want to hard press L cuz if you do that, it's going to like shoot a fireball and that's going to waste a like a tick on the fire bar. If that makes any sense. So this is a bunch of treasure. That's a lot of treasure. Oh, there's a boo. Well, don't <laughs> don't mind me. Just let me pick up all of my gems that I so rightfully earned and then I'll get right back to you. No. So yeah, I could never find all the boos because I didn't even know that this room existed. And this room, you know, obviously has a boo in it that you can see. It. Give me yourself. So that boo went out of the right from where I am. So that might be in the foyer. Unless that's somewhere else. I don't know. So now here, take a picture of the mouse hole. Yeah, I don't know why anyone would think to do this. Like, I don't even know why this is, like, a thing. Oh, the boo's back in here? Oh, or is this, like, the fake? Because I don't think the boo actually returns to the room. Maybe he does? Apparently he does if you reset the game. I think that's what people actually have to do. Yeah, okay, yes, he's a fake. So that's probably what people actually have to do. Which is, you know, uh save and quit the game and then I think the boo actually returns back to the room I don't know why that keeps on hurting me like I'm sucking them in so hello ghost are you in here uh, he went to the rights see like I, I really wish there was a meter for this thing you know what I mean like it doesn't really show you at all where they are and it's kind of really bad unless it does not I just don't see it See, and it's like, I don't know where that ghost is. Like, it, it just went away. But maybe if I save and then uh, look back, it'll be there. But that's stupid. I've never seen a ghost at zero health to get away. Like, that's really odd. Really, really odd thing in Luigi's Mansion this playthrough. Usually these vases will have hearts, which is why I'm constantly checking, because I'm almost halfway. <clears throat> so, what we had do here is I don't know why my throat's like being stupid it's like dying constantly but this room what you have to do is you have to touch every instrument basically and hopefully I can hear this because my volume is pretty pretty low okay we turned in all those and I believe this ghost's name is Melody haha <laughs> yeah Melody so let's see she's gonna play us a song and we have to know what song it is let's see Okay, that is the underwater theme. I think this is the same song that I got last time. I think she'll change it up, but I don't know if she has that many alternate songs that she can play. By the way, what image do you think that piece of composer had? That, that piece of composer, yeah. Water. <laughs> exactly right, you got it right. Very impressive. 
So I, I think if you get it wrong, it doesn't really matter. I, I don't know if you, there's any benefit to the fight where, like, if you get it right. But maybe it makes it easier if you get the right answer. But yeah, this is so much better. Like, most of these ghosts actually got away from me and I had to, like, cycle them back. But this time I can actually get most of them in one, you know, one clean and go. It's really nice. Oh, I was checking that for money. I, I didn't even know there was a boo there. Boomio. <clears throat> no. Uh, okay, he's going to be out here. Actually, I didn't even get the key. I think there was a key in there. No. Like, see, that made no sense. Like, I was hitting the boo. <clears throat> or else I thought. Or else I thought. Yeah, or I thought I was. But I wasn't actually hitting the boo. So how many boos are we at? We are at 10. So yeah, just about as much as I thought we would actually get to. So uh, I'm actually going to stop the video here and I'm going to, you know what though? Uh, actually, hmm. actually, yeah, I'm going to stop the video here. In the next episode, I'll go back to the uh, treasure room and see if that boo is actually there. So see you guys later and goodbye.